Witnesses say the pilot of a small plane was doing stunts in the air moments before the plane crashed. The 32-year-old pilot from Big Lake and his 34-year-old passenger from Maple Lake both died. The crash happened in Clearwater Township in northern Wright County. WCCO's Reg Chapman went there and talked with a woman who saw it happen. He was just doing, um, you know, t spins and turns and, and loops. Darcy and, DeVork uh, says yeah. she and her husband watched what she called a free air show from the comfort of her home. We were just out sitting in our, in our yard and um, he was coming through doing acrobats. For about 10 minutes, DeVork says they watched in amazement as a fixed wing single engine plane, similar to this one, performed tricks in the air. He was just having some fun up there, looked like he knew what he was doing, and then he came around the side of the house upside down and was coming over this way and then went up, nose up, and started kind of doing some turns up and then started nose down. And then the unthinkable. DeVork says the plane started doing turns as it fell towards the ground. And started doing turns and just spiraling really fast and then the engines cut. So we thought maybe he stalled his engine and was going to do something, but we also knew there's all kinds of trees over here and that's all we saw. DeVork says she did not hear a crash. The view from Sky 4 shows what could be a path. Trees sheared off at the top, possibly cut by the falling plane. In five minutes we heard the sirens coming up here and we the sirens were stopping right where we knew the plane went down. Crews responded to the scene to find both the pilot and passenger dead. According to the Federal Aviation Administration, the National Transportation and Safety Board will take the lead on the investigation. According to an NTSB spokesperson, the investigation will be limited because the airplane is considered experimental. According to FAA records, the plane is amateur built. The FAA is collecting evidence at the scene for the NTSB. They hope to find something that will shed some light on what happened in the skies over Clearwater Township to cause the plane to go down. Now, we were told at the scene the passenger in the plane was set to be married this coming Saturday to a member of Maple Lake's Volunteer Fire Department. The pilot was well known in that part of Wright County. Right now, their names are not being released, Holly. So sad, Reg. Uh, <laughs> any idea why the two were up in the plane today? Were they, did they have a destination they were heading to? Well, it is still early in that investigation, but Wright County says the two were buddies who took off in the plane from an airstrip in Clear Lake. Sounds like they were just out to have a little fun when something went wrong, Holly. All right. Thanks, Reg. Mm -hmm.